we are uh, probably uh, we we're almost finished with the renovation of the building 26 years ago, and we realized that we didn't have a name. And uh, I think at the time we were just referring to it as the uh, uh, the, the clinic project. And uh, but knew at that point we, we we better come up with a name. And so we started floating ideas, and, and nothing was really uh, resonating. And uh, it was about that time uh, also. Uh, the, uh, the Denver Art Museum had just uh, started a new exhibit. I think it was on Mexican folk art. And uh, my wife and I had just gotten married and we said, well, let's make a date of it. We'll go to the, the, uh, the Denver Art Museum. So Gloria and I uh, went to the, uh, the exhibit that day on, on Mexican folk art. But part of that exhibit was a sub exhibit that told the story of, of Our Lady Guadalupe and the, the hill at Tepeyac and the miracle of the roses. It's, a, it's an incredibly beautiful story. And uh, but it talked about how Tepeyac was a, a place of healing. And uh, I think it was, it was right then Gloria and I looked at each other and said, we have a name for our clinic. And it was, uh, that's how uh, the name Clinic of Tepeyac came about. I have two uh, uh, thoughts that I wanna share with you. One is I am so impressed that on your first date, after you got married, you went to the Denver Art Museum to see a show. I just, that uh, inspires me. And I think uh, uh, that that's terrific. But far more importantly is um, we're always proud of the Denver Art Museum and our relationship with our community. And one of the things we keep emphasizing and when we open our new building, uh, we're gonna continue to emphasize is our, our openness to the community to uh, all people in the community for all kinds of reasons. And, and you've just underlined the types of things that can happen when members of the community have an experience at the Denver Art Museum. The second thing I'd wanna say is that I've heard many stories about wondrous events that had, had were inspired at the, uh, or started or were inspired by somebody's visit to the Denver Art Museum, but your story is uh, it's the best one I've heard, and it just warms my heart that this great sacrifice you've all made to get your uh, building across the street up to snuff and to make it available as a cl clinic to your community is is really heartwarming, and that we had something to do with it at Denver Denver Art Museum, you know, really brings tears to my eyes. And uh, I just want to thank you so, so much for sharing it with us.